In 2008, Google Cloud Platform was introduced. Initially, it was only available to a limited number of clients and developers, particularly to corporations with millions of users. It now offers 272 services. We're now going to discuss the core services that can help you in your journey to work. The Google Cloud Compute Engine service allows you to deploy compute virtual machines that let you easily launch large compute clusters on Google's infrastructure. If you are working with web hosting and applications, use App Engine Service where you can choose from several libraries and frameworks to develop your apps. Cloud Functions is a lightweight compute solution for developers to create single-purpose, standalone functions that respond to cloud events without managing a server or runtime environment. To automate your operational tasks of container management and built-in commands for deploying applications, you can use GKE Service. To automate your deployment, Cloud Deployment Manager can manage services for you. You may do this by writing flexible templates and configuration files. Cloud Storage allows worldwide storage and retrieval of any amount of data at any time. You can use Cloud Storage for a range of scenarios including serving website content, storing data for archival and disaster recovery, or distributing large data objects to users via direct download. Local SSDs perform faster and have less latency than traditional or SSD persistent drives. To make it simple for you to preserve your data, FileStore offers rapid backups and snapshots. Google Cloud SQL provides relational databases for you to work on data management and analysis. Bigtable provides NoSQL databases and is great for experimenting with large analytical and operational workloads. You may use Cloud Firestore to create scalable databases for server, web, and mobile applications. Memory Store delivers a managed version of two open source caching solutions, Redis and Memcached. Cloud Spanner is Google's scalable, multi-version, globally distributed, and dynamically replicated database. DataPrep is an intelligent cloud data service to visually explore, clean, and prepare data for analysis and machine learning. If you want to find data tools, Dataproc is your best option as it allows you to utilize open source data tools. Cloud Looker minimizes complexity in BigQuery, allowing for faster model building. Dataflow is a fully managed streaming analytics service that minimizes latency, processing time, and cost through auto-scaling and batch processing. You may send and receive messages across different applications using the fully managed real-time messaging mechanism known as PubSub. In relation to your big data warehouses, BigQuery facilitates data management features. Cloud Composer is a fully managed workflow solution that allows you to build, plan, monitor, and manage processes that span data centers. Google Data Studio is a web tool that converts data into customizable informative reports and dashboards. Now, if you're working on machine learning, Cloud Vision can help you with the pre-trained datasets through Data Rest and RPC APIs. To easily train and compare, Cloud Vertex AI brings all the services you need under a single platform. For direct online predictions, Cloud Auto ML Vision allows you to train, deploy, and serve your datasets. The Doc AI platform is a single document processing dashboard that provides easy access to all parsers and tools. Dialogflow is a platform that makes it simple to create and build a conversational user interface. Google Cloud Armor prevents unwanted traffic from consuming resources or accessing your virtual private cloud networks. To ensure the VPN connection, each cloud VPN gateway must be linked to another cloud VPN gateway or a peer VPN gateway. Direct peering allows you to link your business network to Google's Edge network and exchange total cloud traffic. Cloud CDN uses Google's global edge network to provide content closer to consumers, resulting in faster websites and applications. DNS is a hierarchical distributed database that lets you store IP addresses and other data and look them up by name. You may provide your application instances without public IP addresses thanks to the managed network address translation technology known as Cloud NAT. Cloud Load Balancing is a fully distributed software-defined managed service. Anthos is a managed platform for all your application deployments, both traditional as well as cloud-native. If you are using IoT devices, you can use IoT core services to collect the data. API Gateway allows you to develop, secure, and monitor APIs, giving you great speed and scalability so you can focus on other projects. 
If you don't have any coding experience, AppSheet is a no-code development platform that allows anybody without coding skills to create mobile and web applications. Source code from several sources can be imported using CloudBuilt and developed to your specifications and by creating artifacts. Your company can manage container images and language packages all in one location using Artifact Registry. Google Cloud Deploy is a service that automates the distribution of your applications to a set of target environments. For managing container images and other artifacts, Google Cloud's Artifact Registry is a generic repository manager. Audit logs take account of administrative activity and accesses your Google Cloud services. You may manage the content that users can share in files outside the organization using data loss prevention. Cloud identity is a method for managing users and groups in a centralized way. Cloud KMS is a REST API that may encrypt, decrypt, or sign data for storage using a key. To move email and files from your school Google account to another Google account, Transfer Service exists. Transfer Appliance allows you to send your data securely to a Google Upload facility, where it ultimately is uploaded to cloud storage. You can transfer data between object and file storage fast and securely across Google Cloud, Amazon, and other platforms using data transfer. The Admin SDK API is a RESTful API that may be used to create and manage admin-controlled resources programmatically. The interface for learning and experimenting with cloud services is called CloudShell. Cloud Code is a set of IDE plugins that make it easier to design, deploy, and connect Google Cloud applications. Developers can manage and deploy their applications to the Google Cloud Platform within the IDE with the help of Cloud Tools for Visual Studio. That brings us to the end of the video. We hope you've learned a lot about Google Cloud services, and thanks for watching.